So I've been doing photography for my church for a bit, and now we got some new lenses, which we're going to be trying today, and we're going to be going through from Vivitar. So don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, become a member, help support the work that I do here. Even though we are not demonetized, we do not make that much, so I appreciate your help. And beyond that, let's get into the video. In your two boxes, you'll get seven lenses in total in two different carrying packs. So you'll have your filters as well as your macro filters. Now this isn't going to be the best for testing just right here, but we're going to go through it anyway. We're going to start with the macro close-up filters, and then we're going to work our way to the U. UV multi-coated filters and we'll show you the difference you'll be the judge of what you think of them and make sure you're putting these filters on a 67 millimeter lens for this we're going to be using the Canon zoom lens EFS 10 to 18 millimeter lens now let's go now in your close-up macro lens kit you'll get four lenses in total you'll get a plus one a plus two a plus four and a plus ten which will change the amount of zoom that you'll have with each of these filters starting with the plus one Make sure you don't touch the lens at all. Make sure you find which side is the thread and we're gonna screw it on. So this is the plus one macro lens zoom. We'll see what happens with the plus two. We'll then unscrew the macro lens. Make sure you don't touch the lens at all. Keep it clean. Find the threaded side. Screw her on. And as you can see, this is the plus two. It's thrown off the um, focus a bit, but this is where you'd probably zoom in a bit then you'd refocus so you wouldn't really be worried about that outside blur because you're already focused in but you can see on the edges that everything is pretty blurry so that's where you'd use this where you just pretty much be close in now let's move on to plus four got plus four here we're not going to touch the lens at all keeping her clean now as you can see it gets even blurrier if you're not zoomed in so this is the type of thing for the macro lens kit where you'd be mostly doing stills close up flowers nothing that we're doing here right now but for the church photography it's going to be perfect let's get a close-up of puff bro real quick yeah he's looking he's looking solid right there so that's plus four we're moving on to plus ten we're on plus ten that's not drunk goggles i don't know what is so with this you're definitely going to have it on like a full zoom almost and um wow that's just blur no matter what i don't know how i would get this into focus maybe it just needs to be a lot closer oh yeah look at that you can really get up close there with this so this would be full zoom super close that's plus 10 for you guys you can even read the focus v on there we're gonna be moving on to the uv filters that was plus 10 folks first filter we're going with is the uv this is without uv and after we screw this on and this is now with the uv filter so that's the difference there uv filter we're gonna be going through the other two filters that we have here next up is the circular polarized filter so let's get into it. this is without the cpl filter and after we screw it on and this is with the cpl filter for reference just just go back a couple seconds. I'm trying my best to catch up on videos. So we're gonna be moving into the last one, which is the FLD fluorescent filter. This is without the FDL fluorescent filter. And after screwing on, and this is with the FDL fluorescent filter. You can see that it's extremely purple. I've never used any of these filters, but I figured I'd get them to try to be better at photography when it comes to doing my church. Beyond all that, I hope to take classes online for how to be a better photographer, videographer, and all that stuff this year. So Skillshare is definitely going to be where I'm going to go. I would recommend going there too. No promo code yet for, for that, but we'll be looking into that shortly. So thanks again for checking out the video. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below. Also, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, become a member, help support the work that I do here. I understand that this video wasn't exactly the best. I am super behind on videos and all that stuff. And the main video that's really concerning me right now is the stem cell video, which I'm super delayed on coming out with even a return trip information drop on all that. So we will We'll be coming out with that video very shortly we needed to get this video out of the way because i have church on sunday so i thank you for watching it if you didn't it's okay so i appreciate you stay elevated live your best life and peace out